play with my dinosaurs here, and, and I had I had to get them stuck in a trap, you know. But I but I think I made my trap too well because I can't get them out. Hmm. I'm sure gonna need some help though. Hmm. <laughs> I just don't know how. Oh, hi, Holly. Hey, Boggle. <laughs> What's up? Well, can you help me free my animals? Oh, yeah, sure. They're stuck. Let's, mm -hmm. let's get it. Yeah. Oh, this tape is so sticky. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> let's get some of that off wow. here. Wow. Thank you. One, yes. two, and one yes. more. Oh, wow. There yeah. we go. Oh, Holly, thank you so much for helping me. <laughs> You're my hero. Oh, Buckle, anytime. Yeah. And hey, since we're feeling in a helping yeah. mood, mm -hmm. do you want to help me in today's game? <gasps> you bet. <laughs> and friends at home, do you want to help too? Great. Yes. Awesome. We do. In mm -hmm. today's game, we'll have to use our imaginations. <gasps> yeah. So let's imagine that we're zooming through space in a spaceship. Wow! Yes. Oh, Holly, I can look at what fly. I can yeah. see my house! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> we'll have to work together to try and get back the crystal of hope. Ooh! Yeah. Are you guys up for the mission? Yeah! Okay, then let's blast off! <laughs> Hello, Encounter Crew, and welcome to the Spaceship Endeavor. We are on a special mission today to recover the lost crystal of hope. It is floating somewhere out in space. It's a bright red jewel, so keep an eye out for it along the way. We have to be very careful on our journey because the evil alien Zerg and his spacecrafts are out and about. If you're ready to take off, give me a big shout saying, take off. Ready? Three, two, one. One, take off! We've made it to the far boundary of space. But watch out, here come some giant asteroids. We have to be swift to get around them. Quick, everyone lean to the left. Now quickly, everyone lean to the right. Oh no, one straight ahead. We will have to blast through this one. Everyone clap your hands all together as loud as you can. In three, two, one, clap. Great job, everyone. We are safe for now. Now let's power forward. Remember to keep an eye out for the crystal of hope. Put your arms out like an airplane and off we go. Ready, three, two, one, arms out. Oh no, everyone. We have entered into some strong solar winds. It won't be easy, but we're gonna have to climb out of this before our ship is torn apart. We need everyone to stomp your feet as hard as you can to get the power we need to escape. Ready? One, two, three, stomp fast and loud. Great job, we made it. Wait, look ahead. Do you see it? The crystal of hope. Uh-oh, looks like we have company. It's Zerg and his ship of doom. We're gonna have to use our blasters. Here they come. Ready, quickly, clap again. Three, two, one, clap. Got it, we're safe. Now let's get that crystal. Got it. Well done, crew. Mission accomplished. Give yourselves a hand. It's been an honor. Transmission over. Great job working together, friends. You were mm -hmm. all a big help. Yep. And guess what? what? Our song today is about someone who helps us too. Really? Yes. Wow. God helps us do so many things. And he helps us to be brave when we need to be. Wow, that's definitely something to sing about. Yeah. Are you guys ready? Yeah, let's shake out our arms. Oh. Let's, <laughs> now, now our legs. Oh. <laughs> now both. <laughs> It's time to worship. <laughs>
It makes my heart so happy to know that not only do I have my friends to help me when I need it, but I have God by my side too. That's so (laughs) true. Sometimes it's not always easy to help others, but God can help us be brave. Yeah, and that makes me think of someone really awesome in the Bible named Esther. (laughs) I think you mean Esther. But yes, you're right. All right. Esther had to be very, very brave to help the people she cared about. Thankfully, she knew that God was by her side. Wow. Holly, do you think that could be the story we talk about today? Sure. That sounds like a great idea. Great. Let's go say hi to Carrie the dog walker as she fetches this story up for us. Wow. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. job, Stormy Jane. Is that the last one? Oh, hi, friends. I'm Carrie the dog walker, and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. It's so great to see you. Stormy Jane was just being a really big helper and picking up sticks in the park. Here's a treat, girl. Thanks for your help. Oh, speaking of helpers, that reminds me of a great story. Do you want to hear it? Well, today's true story from the Bible begins with a queen named Esther. Queen Esther was one of God's people and she was a super brave helper. Then there was Haman. Haman worked for the king, but he did not love God. Haman had a plan to do something very mean to God's people, Esther's family. One day, Haman tricked the king into making a plan that would hurt all of God's people. Oh no, everyone show me an oh no face. Oh no, if the king hurts God's people, It will hurt Queen Esther's family. What is Queen Esther going to do? Well, when Queen Esther heard about Haman's plan, she was so (laughs) sad. She knew that she needed to help her family, God's people. She needed to go and talk to the king. But Queen Esther also knew that you needed a special invitation to go and talk to the king. She was afraid because she might get in big trouble for going to see the king without being invited. What was Queen Esther going to do? Well, Esther asked all of God's people to pray with her for three days. And after they prayed, Esther was brave and went to see the king. The king was so happy to see Esther and invited her to come talk with him. Wow, way to go, Esther. She was strong and courageous and got to talk to the king. Raise your hand if you want to know what she said to the king. (laughs) Well, she invited him to dinner. Yes, Esther invited the king and Haman to dinner. Esther prepared a special meal for the king and Haman. And during dinner, the king told Esther to ask him for anything she wanted. (laughs) Well, that's when Esther knew she could help her people. Esther asked the king to stop Haman's mean plan and save her family and all of God's people. And the king said, yes. Wow, Esther was brave and she helped her people. God helped Esther be brave, and God can help you be brave too. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can help you be brave? God can help me be brave. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can help you be brave? God can help me be brave. That's the truth, friends. See you next time. Bye. Wow, Esther was so brave. You know, it helped keep her people safe. Mm. Yeah, God helped Esther be brave. And Mm -hmm. he can help us be brave too. Remember, being brave doesn't mean that we won't feel scared or nervous still. Right, But, but, but when we know that we have God, a God who is always with us, you know, who's bigger and stronger than anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So who helps us to be brave? God helps me be brave. That's Mm -hmm. right. We'll see you next week as we discover more together about who God is. And what it says in the Bible. And Jesus's amazing love for us. Yes. Bye. (laughs) Bye Bye-bye.